Wow, Hora Esports. Still very consistent from the previous rounds. My Sky, and now you move in. He's trying to take it out the members of Gig Fam. Aizen! And his teammate Sonics now in trouble with Sonics taking out IZ. One last tick of help. That nade did not land. But you know where IZ is at? IZ managed to heal up with snipes backing it up behind. Kind of, uh, you know, forcing Hora Esports to be in the middle. But you know what? Sky, man, just found snipes. The weapons, MG3 and M4, and my fan ninja who finished off that one last member of Gig Fab. Aaron, however, I'm not sure if he still has enough first aid kit. Uh, he's in a critical position at this moment, not healing a little bit of mid to the base. I'll be hopeful if it goes down there, but yeah, I guess it will go on to the main peninsula. Okay, so Tudor Love, I can see he already has a vehicle, so I guess uh, T2K will be going for that split, of course, to maximize, right? Uh, so they could pillage through the towns and just get everything that they need. But as for the kill feed, it is uh, Daywell United, Snowboy, Joker! Oh man, he is not laughing at all because he is all challenge set by Horror Esports. And again, as uh, you all saw just a while ago, Horror Esports just uh, managed to uh, take control of the uh, high ground. So that is already an advantage for the side of Horror Esports. 50% of health here. Okay, but there's that huge pressure because this area actually is, you know, a part of it is still outside of the zone. But oh, a nade! Oh, oh IHC, come up on top. Circle time. Move down south, Geek Fam has this compound together with Hora Esports. The next clash point. Mm. But it is uh, close with the stat, right? Uh, from Geek, but here comes the spray. Malik wasn't able to put down Apex from that trade. But the good thing about it, this is the fact that, I mean, Hora Esports still with a complete squad. Wow, Hora Esports. Still very consistent from the previous rounds. See here, uh, four vertical vibes. Beautiful squad as well. Also a very consistent performance by them. Let's see who will score this ticket today. It's still kind of hard to tell. Yeah. With the amount of players still left in this ground. And we are only at stage six with Queen. Yeah, and we still got, you know, like plenty of space for this final team. But, ooh, Sky, man. All right, took a lot of the damage there coming from CRS. Sonic, on the other hand, okay, this is uh, quite a long range shot, you know, coming from uh, Sonic. I mean, yeah, it's given up some damage, but not enough to uh, shut down Deontay yet. Now, Hora E4 is going for the uh, quick revive here for Mercal Vice. However, already cooking some nades. I just don't know who is he trying to shut down from that angle. Oh, so for Mercal Vice, if they win the fight. Now, we've got Doc reporting the gun up against Hora E4. Again, try to do a massive spray, but uh, nobody is down just yet. Yeah, and uh, putting a lot of focus onto Hora Esports, but let's not forget about Geek Fam from down south. They can come in any time, oh, no. but Apex went down to Mafia Ninja, Road Rage for the man himself. Look at Geek Fam's movement, they are coming in too, they want to be the cleanup crew. Yes, sir. And uh, I feel like it's going to be a, a split from the side of Geek, but uh, Hora Esports. This could be hard, but the fact that Apex is currently down, so uh, former Echo Vibes will uh, back away a little to make sure that they go for that. They, they go save their teammate, but Hora Esports won't be letting that happen. I mean, it was an aggressive kill coming from Hora. Still, this is a still this is a three-way fight, right? Eleven elimination points for uh, for MV, but it's Geek now that has the biggest chance of scoring the chicken dinner. I'm just checking their position. Hora Esports, man, they would want to finish off uh, the remaining players of Geek before they actually oh. head off to for MV. Oh, for Hora Esports fights back! And they take down one member of Geek Fan. That's going to be the captain, Damro, taken out by him, son. And now the other members of Geek Fam on the other side. Sky prepping up his nade. Sonics with his own nade as well. We're tossing it on the side of Hora Esports. Shot a nade by Sky. And now you move in. He's trying to take it out the members of Geek Fam. Aizen! And his teammate Sonics now in trouble. Sonics taking no. out Aizen. One last tick of help. That nade did not land. But you know where Aizen is at? Aizen managed to heal up with snipes backing it up behind. We're moving on to stage 8 now. Still the circle will shift. Who will be favored by it? Stage 8, ladies and gentlemen. Moves towards the right side. Pretty much all these teams have a piece of the circle. And um, based on what I can see here, Gigfab, only Aizen on the outside. Snipes is within it, so Aizen is the one that has to come in. 
know. I still don't know what's gonna happen, honestly speaking. I mean, this is a Mexican uh, stand-up once again from Geek Mafia, Ninja Horror Esports, and for Miracle 5, okay? Oh yeah, we, we, we can see them going around and just really try to push their boundaries here. Ooh, okay, so we've got uh, Henson, Horror Esports throwing mate, and Molly's up against the Geek. But uh, again, they don't have the exact location, so this is where we say knowledge will always be power. Oh, let's see here. Like what you said, information is key. Knowledge is power. And they kind of have the information where Geek Fam is at, but they don't have to go clear shot. But look at this four medical device coming in from behind. This could be an opportunity for Geek Fam to come in up onto the high ground. Horizon was busy with four medical vibes. Yes, sir. I mean, this is one spot that you don't want to be in. You don't want to be in between two teams, right? I mean, you could be vulnerable in all angles. Um, and uh, former Ecobuzz kind of, uh, you know, forcing Horror Esports to be in the middle. But you know what? Sky, man, just found Snipes and actually shut him down. This is really important for uh, the boys from Horror Esports. Okay, now only Isaac left for Gate Fam. Fires back on the sky. Aizen, no nades. He's going to depend on his trusty weapons. MG3 and M4! And my fan ninja will finish off that one last member of Geek Fab. Now all in focus on the four medical vibes. Alright, here we go. The moment that we have been waiting for. We're down to just two teams remaining for the second wrangle of the night. We've got both of the teams here cooking up their own nades. Having an exchange oh! right now already on the ground. Dog has... Uh, Gotten some damage there, but not enough to shut him down uh, just yet. Let's see. Okay, 30% of health here for the side of Dog of Four Miracle Vibes. Riffus is trying to clap back with the nade himself, but you know what? Everyone is still alive. Baron, however, I'm not sure if he still has enough first aid kit. Uh, he's in a critical position at this moment, not healing up yet, so probably he's out. Okay, he managed to heal up, so he's A-OK. -okay. Same goes for Sky from Hora Esports. Dog, nade after nade after nade. How many nades do these people have? Man, is sent across. Especially from Formidical Vibes! Oh! Now look at this guy! Red Bruce needs to want to take him down! Barry gets knocked down by Mafia Ninja! Barry will finish up by himself! Two more for the side of Formidical Vibes! And yes, oh! Now, an intense fight for Kyle Malik already on the ground! Doc as well pushing forward! Mafia Ninja man getting burned alive! Doc! Okay, still trying to loot some, uh, some stuff here from the carcasses! Now we've got Dog getting uh, harassed! Uh, the remaining members coming from Hora Esports. This is going to be a horror win for the second in Rag of oh, the season. Oh, did he get it? Did he get it? Oh, yes! wait a second. Wait, no! It's four medical vibes! Dog <laughs> got it at the end! My goodness! <laughs> it's a back to back chicken dinner! What? Four 